Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Ark the Lad Twilight of the Spirits with me, Ultra Gamer J. In our last episode, we finished the Ark, or rather, the story, or the tale of Crag, Crag Island, Craw Island, came to a close. And as you can see, it... It seems like Dark really doesn't want to revillage that village. 
or revisit the village because it's not an option anymore. Despite the fact I'm, it's probably because there are only two Slothians there and there are more humans. And I would argue that those Slothians, well, Dark is more Deimos than they are. If anything, the Slothians of Craw Island are the Deimos wannabes. Because they can't use magic, and they can't fight to defend themselves. Honestly, in hindsight, Dark's suggestion to make them subservient would be counterproductive at best. Because they don't have any combat capabilities and they go to sleep at the drop of a hat. out of range. I'm the Pedora. Yes, you are. Folks, out of commission? For now, at least. <sighs> it's not easy being a sniper and the white mage. soften them up for the rest of the team. That is the much smarter decision. So let's do that. Take this! <laughs> so this is pain? Yeah, it sucks. And you have no choice but to live with it. Here. 
prepare yourself. Yeah! Oh. It's my turn now. Prepare to meet your maker. Ha! <laughs> Defy me. Take this. Damn. <laughs> Are you the enemy? Well, I hope Dark's friends and or comrades enjoyed their short stay on Craw Island because they are never coming back after this. I am not joking. The game does not give you an option to return here. Like, after you leave. Avita Sane, Craw Island. First, we should heal up everyone. Actually, maybe Craw is an option. Never thought about that. But let's head to Halshain regardless. Of Hall Shanae. Oh, we can. 
We can go there, but there's not much to explore. <laughs> I was wrong about that. Unsurprising, but still. Interesting to note. Alright, let's see what we got here. Barbadoth. There's the Desert of Death. Ruins. Dang it. And some mountains. Have here. Hello. What do we have here? Deimos had the mental, like, capacity to build refugee camps. ready to tackle that desert again when it's called the Desert of Death. Huh. I guess each one of those four types have their own set of dialogue. Good to know. Sure, why not? The hell? I thought I said yes to listening to it. That's it? You're just gonna blame the Dillsweld for your lot? Does it change?
Wait. Was that a... I thought that was a person standing there, but it's not. I get the feeling he's going to end each of his speeches with that, no matter who we ask or talk to. Call it a hunch. scattered to, to the winds. The Pianta have been, been well, they, they're definitely not walking away unscathed from this. Knocked it down, I don't know what the, I don't know what that exactly means because, well, I haven't looked it up in a while. Damn it! No, I want to talk to the other guy. Oh, you're just as rude as the other one. Tim Webster. Let's see here. Mary Webster Dictionary defines knockdown as meaning to strike to the ground with or as if with a single blow or to fell, which is option. Another is to fell them or to dis dispose of an eider to a bidder at an auction sale. I don't know, I, I'm, I think at least that the third one, or the first one, might be the most accurate, because we haven't seen any other Pianta. Maybe they're just out licking their wounds.
Yeah, this guy is no Tora no Suke from Persona 5. Sorry, dude. You just don't have the charisma. Oh, it was a person. I thought it was a rock. Okay, let's see if we can actually talk to the guy. Come on, Mr. Soapbox. Let's see if you have anything to say. Oh, wow. Speech giver's just as bad as, or just as rude as his, just as rude as his audience. Oh, crap, 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 crap. Pulled it out of here. Start from running when we really didn't need to. Yeah, I am amazed that Demo Society can... Can I? I'm not cutting, I just want to speak with you gentlemen. want to get in line. I just need to talk to you fine gentlemen first. Because it doesn't look like there are any ladies here. Oh wait, that wasn't a rock. That that over there in the distance behind that wind behind that water tank, it's actually another Deimos. Coat demos. Kind of odd for these demos to be wearing clothes. I wonder what tribe they're from. points for at least minding your manners. Then get in line, dude! Also, you are clearly not a Deimos. You're an Alarune-type enemy. next to the water tower thingy.
Well, that's not true. You have a windmill. That's something that's here. And that, and your little water donation thingamabob. You've got that. And also this really nice building. I mean, the inside seem nice enough. I mean, if I absolutely had to, I would live in something like this. Where do I... Wait, is that... Can I... Is that something I... Someone I can talk to? I think it is. Lucky me. were the first ones on the chopping block. That sucks. Yeah. Well, time to see how many answers we can get out of this guy. <laughs> they're dead, then that means they should eventually get across the desert. Before or after they fully cross the desert, because, I mean, unless there's some sort of memory thing that, like, makes them stop crossing the desert after a certain point and then they turn around to come back here. or what do you call it? Wrong buying menu? I don't know. Let's get this diamond coating. Ooh, Trader Soul. We will need one of those. complete Camellia's truck, well, arsenal, well, the weapon parts at least. 
She has a trifecta now. I think that's what it's called. little shopping spree is done. And we have money to spare. It all worked out in the end. Jeez. Yeah, looking around this place, it doesn't look too bad. I mean, just need to get rid of a few unnecessary clutter, and I could see myself living in something like this. If I had to. Another mummy I spy over there. And 
and you're not much help either. have to check that out at, in the next episode. But right now, I think it's time to upgrade. Okay. Looking good there. Stone holder. Did I buy a stone holder while already, despite, oh no, stone bag, which is completely different. so we can use more uh, spells. Dang it, wait. Or should Dark get it? Yes, Dark should get the bag. Dark should get the bag. something. Anything more. And this is my percent Special moves and magic use one for the spirit stones. Because for some reason, Delma is more support-based. Don't ask me why. Hell if I know. These bewitching beads should be a nice fit. Because, to be fair, she did, um, betray Dark. And now let's update Volk's weaponry. Let's see. Diamond coating, definitely. Definitely want to put that on. Give 
than this titanium armband. Shit. And then we'll give him the arm, the headband, because apparently Dark and Volk are the only ones who can equip it. needs to have as much MP as possible, or SP, or... You get the idea. And now, black phone. And now to switch the aiming device with... Some nice death ant nectar. And she is good to go. Now that I think about it, perhaps Camellia should be... Actually, no. Volk has... has Cure 2, so... What about you, Baby Dora? See anything you like? Ooh! Son of a bitch, I thought I turned the... Damn phone alert are off. Eh, why not? Let's give you the steel arm band. Because there is one more merchant Karop we need to see on the course of this journey. No? And there we go. Looks like we are armed and ready. I think I will end the episode here. This has been Ultra Gamer J signing off, hoping to see you all in the next video. And please remember to like and subscribe for more content.